<clears throat> Alrighty. Everybody ready? Looks like we got something on the table this time around. Oh, and just in case anybody's kind of wondering, I disabled ads. Not gonna be able to find it, but there's been like a whole bit of uh, discussion around ad blocks and such, and seeing how you practically get paid pennies, like derivatives of pennies. It's not even worth it, unless if you have like a large amount of viewership in order to warrant the whole CPM. You are never gonna get paid or made whole through ads. So, the best thing you can do to support anybody, especially VTubers like me, spread the word around, make clips. It's especially uh, very helpful for those that mostly have full-time jobs along with it too. Spread the word around, show support. Then always have to be completely financial. Just being there, working, even participating in some other things that kind of spread some. Uh, I hate using the word like notoriety when it comes to like overall presence, but it's the one thing that just genuinely does apply. Screen check off because that's. Disorienting. Language. English. On effects. Sick. Ah, uh, let me lower that to just in case. Just go to the mixer. And there we go. It should be feasible enough. All right, there we go. Shin seven twenty p. It's as high can go. All right, one. X, Y, B, jump A, okay. maybe a little bit confusing since I'm using a PS4 controller, maybe I should switch to like Xbox 360 so it's easier to manage, but as long as muscle memory sets in, it should be fine. Now. The reason why I started this game in particular is because there's a sequel that's coming around that caught my attention. So giving that a shot, I decided to take some looks around. I think I have it in my wish list too, but I forgot exactly what the sequel is called. Once I do find it, I'll pretty much post it up in the chat. Let's see, let's see. Wish list. Let me take take GB02 out of my wish list. I didn't wish list it. But if I do find a creator of this game, I can probably uh, pinpoint what the sequel is. Because I know it's coming around like either next year or. In two years. I forgot. 
Robson Pauv. Paiva. Yeah, there we go. Sessions. Oh, so it is coming out this year. Um, well, close to this year to next year. Quarter four. So let me see if I can post the link of it. Share it around. Add to the wish list too. Because the game looks stellar. It looks absolutely stellar. Uh, yeah, let me see, let me see. Uh... Find it, link it from Steam. If not, I could probably just uh, find the Steam page on the browser and just go from there. I think they've also been showing developer process uh, progress too. They've been showing developer progress to see uh, what kind of things have changed, some improvements, what's going on so far with the development process in general. It's just a whole lot of things that they're adding and tweaking and just showcasing as well. I really do want to give the new game a try. So to prepare myself for that, I am pretty much preparing myself for that. I think it's a much of a game too, so it also does help. It's kind of like taking in the world itself and just figuring out things just through like context clues and what's being provided through the lore. Just to know his uh, username, but <sighs> I've been I've been kind of joining on long enough. Let's start the game. Am I still alive? It's cold out there, and empty in here. The age of humanity is gone. There's only ashes. Day after day, my memories are fading to nothing. But somehow, I'm still alive. I received a message today from an unknown source. Another human. Could it be possible? I need to go check it. Meet me at the... Meet me at the top of the Solar Cathedral. That's what the message says. I need to try one last time. I need to go there. Game's stuttering a little bit. Let me see. 
Is causing the encoder issues. Oh, can't reach there. Right, that's our attack. And these are our safe points. Why such a weird looking insignia? I do not know. with that. I'm pretty sure there's like fall damage too. So let's not break our legs or anything. I mean, we could probably test that. Oh, there is no fall damage. Or maybe there might be some at a very high height. see our first enemy. And it seems like they're also being protected. We don't need to press down at the same time. This uh, LB is good enough. Oh, nice poster. Access to streets and communication pods. Unfortunately, the door is locked. So we're just going to find another way around. Let's see if we can actually uh, product this thing. The blue number above the enemies which is zero, they all get stunned. Stunned enemies take more damage and drop health spheres. But they also can gain back their- oh god. They can also gain back their health too. Or gain back their, their poise. Can't reach way too high. Oh yeah, this game definitely does have a creepy atmosphere though. Alright, let's see our inventory. I copied the message received. Nothing much else. Why they're telling us this? There must be something important that's gonna happen. What are these things? Can't roll cancel either. Hey, okay, calm down there. Calm down. Calm down. Yeah. It's 
so how did humanity manage to fall? Look at these robots. Or is there something more to it? Nope. I dropped like a rock. Can't jump high enough. Damn girl, what do you carry? Is it really that heavy? Turn on the control room. In case of emergency, use electrical switch to open doors. This thing's just look absolutely terrifying. I guess get some health out of it. Pages of a diary. The streets are not safe anymore. You can't see shit with all this fog. It's like something bad is about to happen. I can feel it. If it's one thing that we learn from the mist or Silent Hill, always be wary of the fog. You never know what comes through. Yay. Hey, hey Seiko. Oh. What's up? Ah. Uh. Well, oh, it dropped right on. Seen this? Um, no, I haven't seen recent news. What's up? Like, is something bound to happen to the game, or is it? Is like that one update being delayed? It's separating base PSO2 into free DLC so the game to. Oh! Okay, so now they figured out their solution. So what are people that already have um, both the base game and New Genesis pretty much installed? Do you get to keep that or is that also going to be separated? There's something in this fog that's making people sick. The science department is trying to figure out it. Find a cure. But it's probably too late. Maybe I'm just too worried. I'll take a nap and relax for now. And lo and behold, it was a very deep nap. Oh, I couldn't roll through it. These little things do an insane amount of debt. Like 25 pieces of damage. Oh, I don't think it might be worth it just going through here. I was just try the other way and see where I can see where it's going to take me. Or not. Was this? Oh, it's a post apocalyptic Metroidvania game. Oh, okay. 
I can farm this. Help. Come on. Come on, get me. The game is called Redo. You're basically one of the few last humans on this godforsaken hellhole. And you're just trying to figure out who sent a message telling you to go to the Soul Cathedral. Ow. If I can actually reach those safely, the best thing I can use is a gun. So far, I do not have a gun in, in hand. I have bullets, but not a gun. Otherwise, I would have been able to shoot these things. Oh, it actually heals me too. That's good to know. You see a strange figure trying to say something. Help. Help me. I'm trapped in the TV and I don't know how to get out. I'm stuck in reruns of watching cops and... American Top Gear. <laughs> There's another life I want to live. All right, now we got a weapon. Let's go back. Oh yes, now we finally got our our gun, our taser. It has little damage, but can stun enemies easily. And since stun is a very important thing to use in this game, it's gonna be extremely helpful and just like stopping things down the tracks and opening switches like these but of course you gotta mind the ammo hmm? who are you a human it's unusual how'd you survive anyway you should not be here this area is very dangerous. You probably just die. The Soul Cathedral. What do you plan to do there? There's only dolls like me there. Well, if you want to get there, find a way up. The Soul Cathedral is located at the highest part of the city. Me? I just like to sit here all day. That's all. Oh, so he's a. They're a doll. Gonna shoot? No. I can't shoot like that. Oh God. Uh, let's see. Yeah, there's no point in trying to attack him. There's no point in trying to attack him. S stay back. Stay back. I don't know what your intentions are. Stay back. They can't hit me through. Nope, they can't hit me through there. Wait, what the hell? I thought it was something that was probably going to reach out and grab me. But the whole place does look very elegaic. Right, I can't roll through those. So I guess my best bet is just to run through. So first thing is getting the taser. That way we can actually open these gates. And make a way around. Next thing is to... Uh, find a way to the Soul Cathedral and just piece things together. So let's just go through this way first. This elevator's broken. I didn't much about that. 
However, we can get ammo back just by defeating enemy, destroying boxes, or defeating enemies. Now we got us a shortcut. And I know there are some sections that we can actually use a taser on. This also makes defeating these enemies a lot easier. Let's go down here, see what that's about. Let's get another new weapon. Let's see. We have a riot shield. Protection against physical damage and projectiles. So we can put that here. You will not break the shield. The only thing is that you can't exactly move with it either. So you're going to have to bear the brunt of it. I'm pretty sure it's only for those electrical balls that they shoot out. Not much you can do about destroying those or enduring those. Nope, can't reach. Yeah, there's not much you can do in order to endure those other things. I mean, I could try and test how functional these, the riot shield is. But, at the same time, I don't want to risk just getting killed for the sake of it. 60 damage. No. How much did that do? I gotta jump it. Well, I did 30 points. Uh, you know, let me see first. Let me save when I'm actually safe. <laughs> there we go. Now I can just try out the rise shield. That's also, it does block it. Yep, it does block it. So I actually, I legit found my way to. Nope, never mind. <laughs> it's on the cusp of it. As long as it does not make any full contact within my body, that's I'm pretty much safe. Now, what did that do? Probably open a door somewhere. Ow. Oh. Yeah, probably open a, a door somewhere. But where it could be, I do not know. Maybe I check my map, see if there's anything there. Or I don't think I have a map. Glitch in the Matrix is a possibility. All right, let's take me. Low commercial center. A hey, merchant. Oh, that sucks, buddy, doesn't it? That sucks. I have the power to blow things up. You're not touch me. Hey, how, how are you able to touch me? 
Sh I shouldn't be hurt. But the general atmosphere of this game is unsettling. It's creepy. It feels like you're in a hopeless situation. But the message that you got from this mysterious stranger gives you some reason to keep going forward. And whatever this fog is, is definitely not of a natural composition. If it's causing people to get sick. And just suddenly lose hope. There must be some sort of reason behind it. Why are these machines around? That's also a mystery. But we're going to have to figure it out. One bit at a time. Mighty shield. And right, now we got a health boost. Don't let your window open. Some strange life forms are loose on the streets. Be cautious. Is what are these life forms? Where'd they come from? Are they associated with the fog that's in this very same place? So many mysteries. Oh, calm it down. You happy little ass. Don't you get a bit close to me? Those things do a certain amount of damage anyway, so I don't want them to get anywhere close to me. Let's see. Nothing here other than some lore. And there's also that one section. Probably won't be able to get it until I get like some sort of device or an upgrade that allows me to double jump or a high jump. Double kill. All right, now we unlock the shutter down below, giving us some nice access. Where does it lead? We're currently at Twilight Bridge. No, stop that. Don't get close. So much for a twilight bridge. Jesus, this is Elgig. <laughs> Looks like these heads. Yeah. Don't you shoot? Don't you shoot? Don't you shoot? There we go. 
that's gonna be a pretty long drop and I do not want to drop there that'll just be plainly inconvenient yep there we go just gonna kill this thing though I thought it was gonna be a much deeper drop than I imagined but I guess it's just me being a little bit paranoid I've ever read to be paranoid because well this place is kind of weird Dodge, dodge, swing. I can't move this thing. Maybe there is a way I can actually move, but no dice. We'll probably have to come back here later. Hey there, buddy. Uh, you having trouble? He seemed to have a lot of trouble there. Oh. Hmm, seems like dodge them is not as easy. You could probably dodge through enemies, but when they attack, there's a bit of a window that you can't. Go, 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 go. some health. If you didn't have the riot shield, probably the game plan would have been just to bum rush the thing at its uh, blind spot. It pays for doing exploration. Here. Access to the upper commercial center at Ensola Cathedral. Yep, it is the greatest wall. Who the heck are you? You're just looking ass. Those creatures you kill just want to survive. They're left behind just like you. You gain nothing by killing them. I gain ammo and health. There's plain to gain. But of course, you won't listen. You just stay hidden and wait for the end. But you must insist, right? Pathetic human. Yeah, I am. Pathetic because I want to live. And boy, I would actually be very ashamed of the haircut that I have if I was a doll. Uh, that's this gas motherfucker. You cannot stop raw human potential. Yeah, we have to, we have someone to meet anyway. So we must survive. Alone. Soul Cathedral. One of, these, one of these moments, I'm pretty sure that thing's going to jump out at me. The science department is working on a new synthetic life form. How cool is that? That's not cool. <laughs> Considering what we're up against, it seems like these synthetic life forms are what we're dealing with now. They are built to help circumvent the whole situation involving the mist and fog. The unnatural presence of it has been causing sickness around the world. 
The last thing you want to have is anything that cannot be managed by human hands. But corporate greed. You'll see. Yeah, I did. I did. I did. It looks so cool too. Now I'm just waiting for like the uh, the storm approaching memes for you saying or hung loose since it could just pretty much use rip space to just go in and out of dimensions. I am the storm that is approaching. <laughs> yeah, they really have. They really have amped the production, which makes me wonder how much money have they have they been getting? Just for well, I know that I saw in terms of like revenue, April they have like around had like 1 million it's just a few steps closer to 1 limb billion 2.5 million these total Jesus <laughs> and here's the other thing too I'm pretty sure they're gonna curb a little bit of the whole um, delivery of the uh, the apology things in case they have to like make a bit more money. But the fact that they've been just kind of handing out get the fact that they've been giving out like um, compensation for things that have been pretty much out of their control or just bugs that have been just kind of throwing a wrench in like other people's enjoyment. 2.5 million does not count. She, what? No, 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 wait, wait. <laughs> really? So just from mobile alone, they've made two point five million dollars in two months. I thought Project Mill was a small fan base, but goddamn, <laughs> I guess the whales and I guess all the people kind of jumping ship from different gotcha games and an idea of what the game is about but the story is really good the story is really really good most people are just saying that it's not better than ruin it because we're still kind of in the early stages of um, Limbus anyway we're at chapter we're going on to like chapter 4 and 5 for like season 2 yeah most people, yeah exactly most people just play on PC like, I personally play um, Nike mostly on phone now that I think about it, and Limbus on PC because it runs easier. Shouldn't be surprised considering people whale V2. Uh, it's certain VTubers. But I guess the point kind of still stands. Professor Gaston said it could evolve like a bi biological organism. That's no good. Damn scientists trying to make humans without having a human element. It may feel real, but it probably ain't real to begin with. A broken healing machine. This month is probably going to have a dip because of the dead month. But June, we're going to see a massive spike because of new BP. And yeah. Like the, the, the fact that they had to do the delays does kind of suck. At least they're able to kind of recoup some sort of resources to pull something together. Warning, this infirmary is now responsible for lost belongings. If you need more supplies, search it in the hidden area underneath the big statue. Hmm, big statue. Oh.
Oh god. Help. Help. Frame one. Oh, it's going to be tough to kill these things because uh, they just spew a lot of uh, fireballs out. These enemies are annoying. This situation looks a little dicey. Get blocked, scrub. <laughs> those ah uh, I wish there is something there but maybe I just need to come back to it just need to come back to it another time until I find that equipment there must be something there like you said what can find a machine an old net terminal Can't block that. Looks like I can kind of try. But this area definitely looks a little dicey. Go, 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 go. Better off taking some hits. Oh, they are like Medusa heads. Zap. Zap. And huh. How long this game took to make too. Yeah, the sprite work is amazing. How they're able to capture all this lighting and this elegant nature of the environment. This definitely took a while. I'm sure of it. I don't know if it's also developed by one person too. I'm pretty sure it is, but it's still amazing to see. Get blocked! So it's just pretty much a dead end. Yeah, so it does have like a genesis, a genesis feel to it. Oh shit! Ah. Uh. Maybe if we just shot it, I probably would have been able to cross it. Blocked.
There we go. Hammer it, hammer it. Yeah. That show what we're made of. Now there's a bomb merchant too. All right, line up. Oh, they get shot. Okay, so shooting at them is a bad idea. Shooting at them is a really bad idea. It's just like the miniature balls too. Just hold it. Out of ammo. Nope. Not worth it. Hey, block. I could probably skip the enemy too if I could, but it's just gonna be a bit of a risky jump. All right, there we go. Not worth it considering it took so much damage. And how do I lose ammo? Nope, get away. Oh, the riot shield uses ammo. But why is he charged up? Okay, so that's good to know. The right shield does use ammo. And these things do a shit ton of damage too, so I gotta be... No, let me just go the other way this time. How did the right shield... I have no idea, but... This is the, this is the game's logic we're gonna have here at play. Can't shoot at it. Back, 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 back. Shit. Hey, what's good, Denzel? How's it going? Yep, I did. Got 10 shots. Gotta make it work. Back, 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 back. There we go. Oh, almost. Uh, can't connect here. Oh, there's more of those things too. Get beat down. And there's another doll over there too. Oh no, I don't have enough ammo. And these things don't use don't use a lot of attacks at the 
bring him closest done. Uh, this game is called a Redo. It's a Metroidvania kind of game. No, nope, there was no way I was gonna make it. I didn't have enough ammo, so. Something about this place, I'm gonna have to really make amends somewhere. All of it is just complete treacherous. Yeah, one's a heavy ammo restriction since you can can you can uh, get ammo back from enemies. It's just being mindful of like certain situations where you kind of press to use whatever resources are available against whatever obstacles you're in front of too. Nope, can't dodge those. Let's see, let's see, let's see. So the dodge window is pretty small. Oh, hesitated. Probably try to go around another way, find something else. Yeah, I could probably find another way around. So, you know what? Let me get out of this section. There's another area too. Was that like a dead end though? No, it's not a dead end. The last time I saw a human was 15 years ago. Never thought I'd find one alive again. How did you survive this virus? Well, never mind. The earth is better without. The earth is better now without humans. It's not a peaceful land. Don't try to disturb it. Damn dolls. Yeah, it's not exactly useful when you have these bioorganic organ these um biosynthetic organisms just running a tear. Resistance. Dodge. Hmm. Nothing much here. Yep, HP and stun. If you manage to stun an enemy or kill an enemy while they're stunned, you can get health back. You can do that through your melee weapon and your um, taser gun. The taser can be a bit of a catch 22 considering some enemies do get attracted to the voltage that it provides. I don't think I can make it unless there's a ladder on the other side. Oh, oh.
All right, let's see. Got a new weapon. Let's see. Oh, we got a grenade. But it seems limited. What the hell was that? It's a die for no reason. Or maybe it was a grenade that was, uh, probably set my energy. I didn't notice if it uses HP or not. But I guess when I pick it up again, I'll probably see if it does. Okay, so it goes berserk. Oh, there's something there that... Yeah, there's something in that particular section that kills me. So I gotta be very careful next time. And the number you see underneath, like, the weapons... Oh no, he's charged. Oh, that, that's a GameStop trade. Red? Yeah, he's still red. I'm out of here. Oh, that was that. Go, 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 go. Just grab the grenade and go. There's no point in staying around here. I'm pretty sure the virus is right there. Just take the hit. And go. Be important to us later. Uh, let's equip this to no. E. Let's see. Yeah, it does the job. Provides a nice little uh, cover fire too. Ow. Now we just need to head to a safe zone and just hope to God that we don't get killed in the process. There we go. Now I can just try it out here. Block. It. Oh, that really does help. It doesn't eat projectiles, but it definitely saps the energy straight out of them. Suck it, assholes! Looks like I found my answer. <laughs> we found our answer. Dodge. 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 Oh, no, 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 get away.
Okay, so we can save the grenades for the uh, much more threatening enemies. The ones that have a lot more health than needed. And also clear out some enemies too. Fire in the hole! Lock. Grenade out. Lock. I just need to find a way through. All right, let's take care of that problem. Drop a leg is hot. Drop another one. Dodge. There we go. All right, so I can't go through here. These strange statues are there for some reason. Hmm. All right, let me see. Suck it. Oh, nothing works. Well, you probably need to have something in order to get through that mist, otherwise we're gonna keep dying to it. Said there's a hidden path underneath the statue. Where is it? I guess we won't be able to figure that out until we get something that's important. Another kind of weapon that will help us with that. So, it seems like we've explored this area as much as we could. Next thing to do is to uh, get to the next section. Down to here. Catch! Shit. Send me. It was already gone from the start. If anything, I probably should have thrown two grenades instead. Two grenades and that would have been a dream. Catch! Get! Get! Oh, play be upon ye. Get! 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 Miss fire. Come on. Die. 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 No health. Those eyes symbol on the wall. Yeah. Whatever it is, it's our safe point. Wait, that that's actually from Full Metal Alchemist? Plague me upon ye. Right 
There we go. Now I got something. Come on, stab, stab, stab away. No, I can actually get out of the situation now, can I? Can't get out of the situation. Hmm. The least I can do now is just uh, stun whatever I can and get some health and ammo back. Can you assholes just move away so I can actually go through in peace? Yeah, there we go. So that one jacket that's just kind of hanging around. Just camping the ladder. Alright, ammo. Died with health. <laughs> you know what? Maybe I can actually kill that one thing that's uh, that prowls around. Where we got the energy grenade from? Leg me upon you. It's just stuck right over there. Come on, little mask man, don't you have anything better to do? Instead of just camping the ladder like a chump. I get something back. Can't get anywhere with that. Way big upon you. through this whole ordeal. Oh, come on. Can I not deal with more of these? Fucked up, didn't I? I fucked up. Damn it. 
everything was waiting for me? I'm just folding the left and right. Gimme. Ammo. Bastard. Up, 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 up. Shoot! Alright, come here. Come here. You little chihuahua. Come here. Never mind. I got nothing anymore. Nope, we're back. We're back in it, boys and girls. Come here. Dodge. 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 All right, let's see if we can actually make our way back up and hopefully for the best. Yeah. Oh, what food did you get, Seiko? Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Hey, don't run away. Is this a either? They call it a certain way so I can probably do something against them. Shit, I took too much. So I'll just give up. Dynamite pennant with meatballs. Dinamite? That's some sort of foreign concept. But what's in it actually, other than the meatballs? Oh, now this one's heated. Zerk one. Ah. Dodge. Oh, fucked out. Should the metal arrow you though? Come on, die, 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 die. Yes, I get two back too. It's pasta with cheese. Hmm. I mean, it's, the way they put it sounds a lot more boring than I thought. Like, when you have, like, dynamite, you expect, like, you know, an explosion of flavors. Just like his namesake. It's supposed to be dynamite. Not bland. Yeah, there's no way to actually block the damn thing. There's gotta be something better around here. Let me look. Yeah, let me look around. 
I could probably just... Oh, no. Oh, this fucking sucks. All right, let me see. Maybe there's a way around this. Maybe there is a much better way around this. Sticking to me like glue. To a hundred for Jesus. Let's see. Hey, hey. All right, now. Enjoy your engine grenades. There we go. How much uh uses uh two it uses uh two ammo. So essentially I have uh five grenades. Yep, my ammo shared. So that's why every now and then, whenever I have to have to debate on using either grenade or something else, I have to be very tactical about it. After all, you're the only only human in the you're the only hu supposedly you're the only human in this world. But there's someone else there. Ah. I tried this section before, but just end up dying to the floor. Shit, there is another way around. Burn, 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 burn. Yes! Like the heretic that you are! Alright, now I got more HP. More survivability. Up. Uh. Come on, 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 yeah! Come on, swing at me, swing at me. Swing, 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 swing. Swing, 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 swing. Swing, swing, swing. Bitch! Bitch! Now I actually got enough to really take the other one that's roaming around. Catch. These nades. Son. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Hey, we got a new weapon too. Sweet. All right, now we have a stun gun. A stun gun creates create a big discharge that stuns enemies up close. That might actually be good. But does red meat their berserk? So they have much more health. Thankfully, not more stun. Well, some enemies do get more stun. So they're kind of hard to take down. Yeah, yeah, this is essentially a shotgun. And just like a shotgun, you use like two shots. Uses uh, two ammo. Ah. Oh no, he's angry. He's angry. 
I got those. I'm the, the I am the, the Kimmy Matumbo of the apocalypse. You cannot touch this. All right, now I can probably. Can I knock this down? No, I can't. All right, now there's a good example. See those two long face guys? One has 45 health, the other has uh, 90. Essentially, it's a 50% increase in whatever stats they have. So they're 50% angrier at me for surviving. Yep, these guys are random chances to go berserk. So I think in some cases, if you kill an enemy more than enough times, it increases that chance. Water torture? You just want me to be very hydrated, that's all. And I only have some tea. So I don't think that possibly counts. Ah. I like the sheer amount of horror that they have in their face whenever they're like actually close to stun or whenever they do get stunned. <laughs> I do appreciate the redeems. I'll make sure to drink enough water throughout the entire day. Hey. 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 All right, now let me actually try the stun gun. See what that's about. Ugh. Another doll. Hey, why the long face? Yep, I got something. Something in the goods department. Strange. I feel at peace being here alone. It's like I could dissolve in this fog. Is this a human feeling? Oh no, you tell me. Shit. <laughs> Alright, now he's charged up. Fuck, run. Yeah. Eat it. Uh... Oh, he lost a stun gun.
Whatever that's whatever's above us is spewing those fireballs is not gonna make it easy. Yep. Just a tip of the iceberg. Oh, he's all such Ugh. It's a brain. Might just keep swinging. Okay? Swing. Die. Oh, I'm dead. I guess I hit harder too. Yeah, the box says just blocking the way. Go, go. Fuck. Too late. Oh, don't be crispy. Hold up. I can't pause the game. I'm pretty sure it's those robot calls again. Can you stop calling me at the wrong times? Fuck! Keep dishing me too, you jackass. The first time he called and didn't even bother leaving a message, the second time he called, now you do. Hang on. No, he did leave a message. You prick. Oh, fuck. Goddamn robo calls. Kind of safe. Oh. So when the thing comes around, that's when it can actually. Throw some energy grenades at it too. Rish is going to one shot us too if we're not careful. So, one thing we can do. Wait for that. Dissipate. Alright, what's in the box? I got two shots. Yep. And as soon as it gets close, let him have it. I'll teach that floating brain to just uh, disrespect us. Done. Oh, we'll cover fast. I'm sorry, you are the greatest. You are the greatest. What? I can't exactly zoom down to see exactly what's below me either. Just got to remember exactly where it is. Jump. 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 And 
Out of here. Wait. That's the Soul Cathedral. Yes. We're at our destination. We just need to make our way up. It sounds like there's more of those brains nearby, too. Let me see what's down here first. All right, now I got a shortcut. We just have to survive. Okay, so we're making a good amount of progress, surprisingly. Open the shortcut. Now I could actually head to the Soul Cathedral and just uh, trip whatever we need to do there. We could also try to get that stun gun back and just uh, get some more stuff on at, at our disposal. Fuck. Back, back, back. Go. Also get an ammo expansion too, that'll also be very helpful. Come here. Come here. Burn. Burn to the ground. Bah. So we got what we need. Let's head to the other section and see if we could get those that one item that we did miss out on. Oh no. I fucked up. I fucked up. I fucked up. Yeah. Angry? Good. Stay angry. You mad, bro? Stay mad. You salty? At least you got some seasoning in your life. The uh, armor course falling means moonshine's crazy shit. I'm expressing the pink red. A oh, Pippa? <laughs> I'm pretty sure there's gonna be some crazy shit that Moonshine's gonna come up with. Especially with Pippa involved. I doubt that she's actually uh, aware of, like, Armor Core, but hey, if it makes her aware, it can make anybody else aware about it, too. If it's one thing for certain, we definitely made sure that Armor Core has uh, maintained Relative cult status. No matter where we go, shit. No matter where we go, what we do. Oh, this thing's powered up. Fuck. Off. Please. To enjoy the huge, of course. Who wouldn't enjoy the huge missile? <laughs> Who wouldn't enjoy the huge missile? It sounds so wrong saying it too, but fuck it. Dab. Oh, that hit me? That's cheap. 
I can hit him too. Double the health. One. Two. Dead. All right, now we got two. Now we're going to get three. The stream is brought to you by uh, Count Chocula. Encouraging people to know how to... The count those us count the amount of dollars they're gonna be spending on dental bills. The amount of sugar that's in those cereal. I mean it still gets a point across one way or another. Here, ow, all oh, right, that thing. Just got to make sure I don't drop into the fog. Surprise. Block. Not a block. Call me Terkuz, I'm still blocking all y'all. Shit. I'm almost dead. No health recovery. No hope. No dreams. I'm useless. No cares, no fears. I'm ruthless. Right, uh, let's see if we can drop here. And new weapon. A submachine gun. And we got out of here. <laughs> oh, now we are living the life of Riley. We just need to get out alive. I think we can aim upwards, though. That's the other thing. It's a logical progression. Is indeed a log logical pro progression. Just need to find the last switch so we can uh, unlock that door. Oh, wait, never mind. There it is. Why did I come back though? Climb, 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 climb. Down. Let's see. Sweet. Got this unlocked. How far are we to the next save point, though? That's what I want to wonder. Well, this place does look familiar. Can 
In fact, this is pretty much the first starting area. So we now have some uh, connecting paths. Yes! Now I can actually try out the submachine gun too. Let's see. <laughs> oh, this is fun. Already, we have power in our hands in the form of an MP5K. Wait, MP5, MP5. Even in the future, we still have the good old MP5. Yeah, that, yeah, we could probably try that. We could probably try that now. We could also probably kill those uh, crawler things too. A lot easier. And those uh, spewers. so many of these spewers. Charm improves the gain of health from garbage piles. Okay, so probably the boxes and other stuff strewn around this place. Basically, it's just some sort of survivability. Come on. Nope. Let me play it safe. I'm going to head back to the save point. So maybe somewhere down the line, I could actually get. Uh, what's it? I can, uh, hopefully there's actually a tool that allows me to jump from one save point to the next. That's my main concern. Once we have that, that's pretty much full runnings. It is quite the trek. If we can get back to our initial save point, though, nearby the infirmary, we can Definitely make a lot more progress and be close to the Solar Cathedral, too. Which gives us the incentive to just keep going. Like, we have plenty of health in our tanks, certain things. And above all else. Above all else, we have much more survivability in tow. Okay, so that, so those things are called garbage piles. Right, go, 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 go.
Oh, that is really helpful. Yes, now I got 13. Hmm. Some kind of telescope. There's a note near it say I'm not able to see the stars anymore because of the thick fog. I have a feeling this fog isn't natural, like it wants to hide something. Something that maybe we're not supposed to not we're prepared to see. Yes, yeah, it deals direct damage, so it's good for shredding targets that have a lot of health in tow and also pierces, so it's good for clearing out crowds. The only caveat is, of course, no stun damage. Which is, I'll take the trade off. Hmm, much here. So I'll find a way in order to break those statues or at least interface with them. Oh, there's Nile. The Nihilist. If only I could just end your life, so it would be much easier. Don't need much more negativity in anyone's life. Alright, now. Let's head to the Soul Cathedral. Save here. Now let's test. Okay, it doesn't do a whole lot of damage. Yeah, I think that might be a good idea too. Uh, let me see, stun gun. Let's set that to two. Or just have like a stun gun and an SMG on hand. That's a wind up. Okay, so it, I think it's actually okay that it has some sort of lunge to it, but you really have to be prepared for what comes next. Why are there a lot of dolls here? Why did you come here? This is a place of rest for dolls. And most of us don't have fond memories of humans. In fact, I say that some of us may want to kill you. A message from another human? I don't think there's a human here. I also don't have access to other parts of the cathedral. Now that you mention it, there's been some strange messages being sent from unknown sources. Could it be from another human? It could be coming from the top of the cathedral. The door behind me, you'll need to find a way to open it. 
The other dolls may have some information about how to do it. Ask them. Alright, now I got a new weapon, and that's the shotgun. Oh, a hand cannon! High in stopping power. Yeah, yeah, someone probably just wants dead. We just gotta figure it out. Who's friendly, who's not? I don't want to talk to you. You should check out the sculptor's building. Long ago, he did all the statues inside the cathedral. Human? Human. You'll need two car keys to open that door, human. Have you ever heard about the sculptor? Hmm. Leave me alone. The science department is a huge underground facility. You should check for the car key there. Do you want to be my friend? I mean... Sure. The sculptor's building a science department. You should check those places. Okay, so those are the two... Can I have your guns when you die? They look cool. <laughs> At least you have your priorities there. There are some invisible things inside the sculptor's building. You're gonna die for sure. Okay, so. The science department and the sculptors. Uh, the sculptor. A pile of corpses. That's just some kind of deity. So once we have those car keys from the science department and the sculptor's building, that's when we can open that door. Those are our only chances of getting to that particular area. It's just figuring out where they are to get the idea of where to go. But now I have an objective in mind. Those are the two sections we need to go to. That's it. We're just going to make our way down. But I guess it'd be a good idea to save. Access to the sculptor's built. Okay. So now we actually have the means in order to get through there pretty easily and clear out the crowds. Also, I want to figure out what this whole uh, stun cannon deal is. That's something the uh, hand cannon is. Burn hole! Burn! Oh, that, that is a shotgun! That is wholeheartedly a shotgun. So there's some of them here. Fire and hole! the only problem. Oh, but these blow them apart. That gives us a good idea now. I 
Oh, that's right. Let me switch over to hand cannon again. There's one other place that has a statue. That we can use the hand cannon for. What happened? Remember what that one doll said? There's something in this particular building that if I stay too long there, I'll die. Essentially, the, the virus is there. So I'll die in certain areas. If I'm not too careful. Got it. Right. Fire in the hole. It definitely does a shit ton of damage. I should bring the rise shield with me, though. Uh, let's see. Replace this. There we go. Iron hole. Berserk one down there. Up. Oh. Oh. Iron hole. Life is definitely good. We are so in it. Definitely in it. We just gotta make sure we don't fall to the fall to the bottom parts of the um, facility. Otherwise, we die. Zap, zap, zap. All right, now this is section two. There seems to be a high concentration of this fog. So falling. Oh. It does a shit ton of damage, but we're lucky to be alive. Let's go, let's go. So, th that invisible force. Oh, an, an EN shield. 
Energy shield offers protection against energy projectiles and slow down enemies inside it. So, we're going to be playing a little bit riskier. Since we have a lot more stuff that uses more energy. But it has startup. But this actually eats projectiles, so that is a worthwhile trade-off. It's a, it's a stasis shield, if, any, if anything. So I can say, ah, uh -huh. suck a dick. Uh. Yo, definitely working the flamethrower guy. Sure. Find hole. Overshot it. Can't pause the uh, game in the menu. So, set up. Yeah, that's a combo. Let's get our health back. Throw a grenade. A fumble. At least we know that it, the uh, mist does a set amount of damage too. I get like half my health when I was not careful. But we probably need to get something in order to endure. Is a kitchen gun. Solves all of our problems. Nice burst. Spread. I think it's a little there. <sighs> yep. Find a hole. This. There we go. Sometimes it's just worth the use of resources. Let's also try the stasis portion of it too. Yeah, it works like a dream. A million dollar dream, I tell you.
Ah. I probably should put up the stasis field. Alright, hole. Let's try all oh, the grenades too useful so we can just move on to that one. Nope, never mind. Hmm. Let's try a good combination then. And go with energy. Was pretty slow, so we can use that to our advantage. <laughs> Not the most optimal. Let's uh, end it here. Yep. End it all. Like having the means to stun still does seem very important. Let's try this combination. Right, no grenade. That is so that's good. Okay, he's here though. Yeah, this is good. This is good. So enemies that have like aggro once they are in stun, I could just slow them down and just blast them with the hand cannon. There we go. Now to wait for this guy to get out the way. Take from the trash heap. Get some health back. Got some ammo too, so we got a good a good balance going. Hmm. 
Hmm. Something, there is something here that's killing us slowly. Question is what and how can we get to see it? Ah, shit. That's a ticket. And when they're stunned, they tell us to take much more damage too, so that works in our favor as well. Problem is that Stungan takes so much, so much wind up. Turn around, turn around. Oh, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Try the combination again. Shield. on the way. Hmm. All right, one more call, let's try, and then I'll just um, call the day from here. Nope, 
can't do that. There we go. What's the other one? All right, come on, you floating meatballs. All the problems disappear. All right, that's good. Get some health back from that trash heap. Sure, not to fall this time. Closer. Oh, that's funny. That's real funny. A new tool. Was a gain of bullets from boxes. So something tells me I'm supposed to visit the science department first before. And to the scope of this building because whatever is out there that's killing me is gonna keep me from getting that key card. Essentially. I have no choice but to just retreat. So until I get that particular item that allows me to pass through those invisible forces, I won't be able to go through the sculptor's building in earnest. That's essentially what it means to me now. is where is it where is that science department they said it was on the ground somewhere
Perhaps there is something here. Something we could actually use. it takes us downward I think that would probably be the best way to look best place to look Best place to look. Just gonna keep heading down until we start seeing some unusual things. That's usually our best way of going about, you know, the Metroid approach. Okay, man. Commercial Central and Solar Cathedral. I need to get to that section too. How I get there before I gotta remember. Alright, yeah, here we go. I'll take it to the underground laboratory. I think about it. Was there some things blocking the way too? inside right now yeah it does work it yeah, didn't really check this area out piece of a diary those boss oh, those boss synthetics invade the building so I'll stay here and wait Fuck, I'm so drowsy I'm so tired I need to sleep and then Heard from no more. Oh. 
There we go. That's a good trade. And a weapon. A rocket launcher. Fires tracking projectiles that deal great damage. I wonder why they're giving us a rocket launcher now. Seems like there's going to be something very dicey that's coming up, huh? Some bosses. Message. I'm waiting for you at the top of the Sword Cathedral. That's that science it though. Next is this. So the science building is definitely close by. You're not welcome here, human. I know. Give us alone, human. We are not your object anymore. I don't even got to bother saying that sentence. <laughs> Who knows what kind of asinine or horrendous shit you're seeing behind that binary. But it seems like this whole thing is just a revolt from the dolls. I don't know why. Why they seem so hell-bent on not allowing us humans to live. Maybe the fog is some sort of virus, like one of those dolls said. Something that keeps us from staying alive. We have to find another way around. Come on, come on. Am I stuck? I'll check our starting area and see if we're missing something. There's a way to get back up here. So wherever we go, might be the place where we need to come back. There's a lot of exploring to do, that's one thing for sure. Access the streets and communication pods. What's it says? Feeling lonely? I do So they really got tired of getting fucked with. Both figuratively and literally. <laughs> Alright, oh. 
Let's make our way up. Boom shakalaka. Necessary usage, but okay. Much here to explore. It's nothing much anymore. Let's head up, and we need to probably head up and over so we can actually get to the science department. Because we definitely saw some sort of underside area that we can navigate through with that shortcut ladder nearby. Wait a minute. I want to test something. If it does what I think it does. Nope, it does not. Or maybe if the boxes were a different color. Help us break those statues, also. But I have no faith in that. Also get rid of that brain thing too. With the kit that we have now. get down there too. Is broken. Yeah, 
Yeah, this section. This section. We haven't gone through that part entirely, too. Yeah, the uh, the W Corp ones for Yi Sang and Hong Lu, right? The storm is truly approaching. I can actually jump over them. Back. Yeah, most likely season two they might get some uh, some ones that actually use charge. Like we still have plenty more W Corp and R Corp to go. But maybe some Somewhere down the line, I also get the uh, cane office too. Actually, be a good place to uh, save up. Cane office. <laughs> I can see the dream. I can see it. Like Mercil would have uh, Bada's ID. I don't know who would have uh, Nemo or Martha's. So, thinking about it now. Nemo, you saying? I think that might work. Might be a contrast to like how Nemo usually acted, but it might work. with a try but unfortunately didn't work dodge yep. the only event we're gonna get in season two is magical bus adventure and there'll be some mini fin but a big one is yeah I really good believe that it's gonna be something a prep for something big. Just like how 3.5 kind of ended off with a very interesting conclusion. Where Sam Joe was kind of hinting at something special for a client. So there must be something coming up. Something in relation to you saying for this particular chapter. Yeah, he might be a big character, maybe someone in relation to uh, Kubo. There's a good chance. And energy so I gotta save, I gotta save, I gotta save, I gotta save. I really gotta save. Or I could just probably risk it and see where else I can go.
be making the biggest mistake possible. Using season two to fill up with mirror dungeon egos or something. Yeah, it. I feel like it was only a matter of time before we start seeing either of them becoming egos or actually facing them off in Refraction Railway. Mirror Spider. There's one that I probably want to see. This place. Oh, we got an axe. Quite a bit of stuff. Pages of a diary. The fairy guy. Yeah, I. Kind of nickname him the, uh, the lean. The king of green lean. The king, the green king of lean. No more work today. I guess that old bastard was right in the end. How exactly he didn't know the exact location, uh, location of these statues. Those pieces are at least 10,000 years old from an old civ- Oh no. How the sculptor knew this location? Well, I think it's none of my business. The excavations will still continue for some time. There's still some places left to explore. And if the sculptor is really right, we'll find much more. It seems that that sculptor is something, uh, you shouldn't have trusted. Some made them. I need to find a save point ASAP. And too greedy. Oh, God. Back away. Whatever it is, it's dead. We don't have to worry about it anymore. And now I got a new tool. And now I can see the hidden enemies. All right, we're really gonna have to trek all the way back. Well, of course we are. No, in this game. At least we can hope that the enemies do not respawn. Whatever's left over, we should be good to go. Get away! Oh, no, oh, no, 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 I'm out of here. I'm out. I'm gone. So you know what? So we can now see whatever is going on. We could pretty much take them on. I want to save by the infirmary, but I feel like I'm maybe pressing my luck. Come on, let's make the jump.
Mm, it also gives him health just to give himself some uh, insurance. A little bit of insurance. be by the infirmary but at least we have a good idea of where to go so just to remind ourselves we're gonna be heading after this stream we are gonna be heading to the sculptor's building again since we can now see whatever invisible forces are attacking us and above all else we can try to get the key cards from both the science department and the sculptor's building once we get those we head back to the soul cathedral and then we just lost, we just let the magic happen. So, thanks everybody for stopping on by. Hope you had a wonderful time for watching Redo. I am genuinely enjoying this game a lot and it's been a while since I last played any kind of Metroidvania games with this kind of atmosphere. But man, I'm glad I'm gonna be streaming this again uh, later, on the, in, later on this week, most likely Thursday since we're following B schedule. And let's actually put that up for everybody else to take a look at. So, Tuesday, Thursday, redo. Friday, we have Little Ocean Nobetta. Saturday, New Genesis. And Sunday, we have Armor Core 2, but it is exclusively on YouTube. That's where I'm streaming it. But until then, catch all guys, gals, and pals another time. Peace out. And uh, have a nice day, night, or afternoon, wherever you are in the world. Oh, excuse me, I'm gonna need to take a shower. Remember, as always, remember these rules as part of your mission. Rule one, you represent me by proxy, so be in your best behavior. Anything you say or do will reflect on me as a whole. Rule number two, if you do enjoy the person's content, support them the best way you can. Affect that. Respectfully and responsibly. Because you know ad revenue is not really going to be paying anybody big buku bucks. And rule number three. Be excellent to each other. Because we never know what someone else is going through behind the scenes.